Imagine the shockwaves across the auto industry when a CEO steps on stage and confirms that their most secretive, most talked about engine isn't just a rumor. It's real that's exactly what Mercedes has done. The company has finally revealed that the Yasa Flux engine exists. An engine once whispered about in hushed tones is now front and center, and this isn't just any motor, as early reports claim it's so powerful and so radically different that giants like Tesla, BYD, and Toyota could soon be losing sleep. If this engine makes its way into production cars, the entire game, petrol, diesel, and even today's electric batteries, could be flipped on its head. But the big question remains, what makes this engine so special? Is it truly the game-changer the industry has been waiting for? Or is it just another flashy promise destined to fade away? And if it really delivers, could Tesla's EV dominance finally be under threat? One thing is certain. Revolutions in car tech don't just appear overnight. They're born from years of research, hidden experiments, and carefully guarded strategies. The Yasaflux engine is no different. Many assume it surfaced suddenly, but in reality, Mercedes has been quietly working on it for years out of the spotlight, with no grand claims, no hype, just relentless work behind the scenes. That silence was all part of Mercedes's master plan. Let's rewind for a second. Between 2010 and 2015, the EV wave really exploded, and Tesla proved with its early models that electric cars weren't just the future, they were already here. Mercedes, watching closely, knew one thing for sure. If they wanted to stay relevant, betting only on batteries just wasn't enough. They had to reinvent the motor itself. That's when their eyes landed on a small but brilliant British company, Yasa. This startup was already experimenting with axial flux motors, and their early prototypes hinted at a technology that could completely reshape the industry. Mercedes saw the potential, stepped in with support, and by 2019, they took full control of Yasa. That move laid the foundation for what is now being called one of the most disruptive engines in modern automotive history. From the outside, it looked like a simple business deal, but in reality, this was the step that laid the foundation of the Yasa Flux engine. Mercedes poured millions of dollars into the project, gave Yasa full funding, and put hundreds of engineers to work day and night. Over the past decade, this quiet partnership has transformed into one of Mercedes' boldest innovations. The company kept the project so secret that even industry experts had no clue. People assumed Mercedes was just focused on luxury EVs, but behind closed doors, they were building an engine that could shift the direction of the auto industry. The second big factor in this master plan was timing. Mercedes never rushed to launch the technology, as they knew that if they released an incomplete or weak product, companies like Tesla or BYD would ridicule it immediately. So they tested it thoroughly. Thousands of hours of driving simulations, experiments in every condition, until they were fully confident. Only then did they announce it to the world. This move shows how much Mercedes has learned from Tesla. Tesla enters the market with a lot of noise, but Mercedes kept quiet, waited for the right moment, and then struck. This is their master plan, say less, do more. So what is the Yasa flux engine? Think about it. Whenever we talk about cars, the first thing that comes to mind is the engine. Once petrol and diesel ruled the roads, then the era of electric cars took over. But today, the name making the most headlines is the Yasa Flux engine. Mercedes has revealed it, and discussions about it are spreading all over the world. But what exactly is this engine, and why is it considered so special? Okay, let's break it down in the simplest terms possible. Yasa is a British company that originally developed this engine technology before Mercedes took it under its wing. And flux simply means magnetic flow. Now, just so we're clear, electric motors work on the interaction of electricity and magnets. Normal electric motors, which we call permanent magnet or induction motors, are thick and bulky. They take up more space and weigh a lot more. But here's where the magic of the Yasa flux engine comes in. It's very small, lightweight, and extremely powerful. Its design is called axial flux. Now, what does axial flux mean? 
Well, let's put it in simple words. A normal motor rotates like a cylinder, while an axial flux motor rotates like a flat disc. In other words, instead of being a thick cylinder, this motor is like a thin round plate. The same question is being raised today about Mercedes's Yasa flux engine. From the information that has come out so far, it's clear that the flux engine will currently be installed only in luxury and high-performance cars. The biggest reason for this is its initial cost. Being a new technology, its production cost is high, and companies would like to install it first in those vehicles where the price is already high. But this does not mean that it will always be expensive. As mass production begins and the research cost is recovered, this engine can also reach affordable cars. Now, let's talk about the challenges of manufacturing. The design of the flux engine is as unique as it is difficult to make. Companies have been manufacturing ordinary motors for decades, but the production of an axial flux motor is completely new. It requires very precise magnets and coils, and it is not easy to connect and balance these machines. Mercedes may have the technology, but if it has to be installed in lacks of vehicles, then it will have to prepare for mass production. This is the biggest challenge. Along with this comes the stress of raw materials and supply chain. Flux engines require rare earth elements such as neodymium magnets, and their supply is already limited to China and a few countries. If the demand for flux engines increases, the shortage of these metals may grow further. This will increase prices and put pressure on companies. To deal with this problem, Mercedes will have to find new suppliers and perhaps also pay more attention to recycling technology. Now, the question arises, when and how will the Yasa flux engine arrive in future cars? Mercedes is currently preparing to bring it in its luxury sports cars and high-performance models. Flux engines can be included in vehicles like their AMG series. Its advantage in SUVs will be that despite being a heavy vehicle, the flux engine will give more torque and more power, making the driving experience of the SUV even more fun. At the same time, the use of flux engines in sports cars will make them capable of competing with vehicles like Tesla's Model S Plaid. Flux engines can also bring a big change in trucks and commercial vehicles. You see, heavy vehicles need more power and torque, and flux engines deliver more power despite being lighter, which means that electric trucks and buses will hit the roads with more range and power than before. If we look at the picture, after 2030, the flux engine can become the new standard of the EV industry. Just like today, every company uses lithium-ion batteries in its cars. In the coming time, every company could move towards motor technology like flux. It is possible that in the coming seven to eight years, this technology will become so common that even cheap electric cars will start getting flux engines. But here a big question arises. Is this really the future of the EV industry or just another corporate promise? The long and storied history of the global auto industry provides a sobering and often repeated lesson. Many times, ambitious companies talk big, generating immense hype with grand announcements and futuristic prototypes, but their promised technology simply does not turn out to be as effective, reliable, or commercially viable once it finally enters the rigorous world of mass production and faces the unforgiving realities of the open market. Concepts that seemed revolutionary in the controlled environment of a lab or a press conference can often stumble when confronted with the complexities of supply chain constraints, manufacturing scalability, cost control imperatives, and the diverse, often harsh conditions of daily use by millions of everyday drivers. The real, ultimate test of the Yasa Flux engine, the moment of truth that will separate revolutionary breakthrough from mere corporate promise, will therefore not occur on a stage or in a carefully crafted marketing video, but when it is fitted into the vehicles of everyday customers and silently, or perhaps not so silently, proves its worth over hundreds of thousands of miles on real roads across every type of climate and terrain. So now, the decision, the judgment, and the speculation are yours to consider and share. Do you genuinely believe, based on the evidence and potential presented, 
that the Yasa Flux engine will truly and fundamentally change the future trajectory of electric vehicles, becoming the new foundational technology that redefines performance, efficiency, and packaging for a generation? Or, given the historical precedent of overpromised and underdelivered automotive innovations, do you suspect it will ultimately fade into obscurity like so many other next big things in a few short years, relegated to a footnote in the history of automotive engineering? What is your informed opinion, your calculated prediction, or your gut feeling on this pivotal moment in automotive evolution? Tell us your thoughts, your analyses, and your forecasts in the comments section below. We are genuinely eager to read the diverse range of perspectives from our insightful community. And yes, a sincere thank you for staying engaged and watching till the very end of this video. Your time and curiosity are greatly valued. If you want to continue this journey of discovery with us, don't forget to subscribe to our channel to ensure you see more such amazing, well-researched, and true stories from the ever-evolving frontiers of technology and industry.